Why do some say that Jesus is the only way to God? Those who say that Jesus is the only way to God do so for seven reasons. First, Jesus is the only one who has said that he is the way to God. Believe in God, believe also in me. I am the way, and the truth, and the life. No one comes to the Father, except through me. If you had known me, you would have known my Father also. No prophet, no holy man, no religious leader has ever dared to say as much about himself. Second, Jesus is the only sinless one whose death takes away the sins of human beings. I am writing these things to you, so that you may not sin. But if anyone does sin, we have an advocate with the Father, Jesus Christ the righteous. He is the propitiation for our sins, and not for ours only, but also for the sins of the whole world. No other man led a sinless life or died as a sacrifice that brings forgiveness for others. Third, Jesus is the only one who promises eternal life to all who trust in him. Whoever does not honor the Son, does not honor the Father who sent him. Truly, truly, I say to you, whoever hears my word, and believes him, who sent me, has eternal life. He does not come into judgment, but has passed from death to life. All others tell us to do this or that in order to please God, threatening us with judgment. Fourth, Jesus is the only one who has fulfilled the promises made by the true prophets about a coming Savior. You search the scriptures, because you think that in them you have eternal life, and it is they that bear witness about me. If you believed Moses, you would believe me, for he wrote of me. The first prophet spoke nothing about anyone else who would be greater than Jesus. Fifth, there is only one whom God has designated as mediator between himself and us humans. God our Saviour desires all people to be saved, and to come to the knowledge of the truth. For there is one God, and there is one mediator between God and men, the man Christ Jesus, who gave himself as a ransom for all. Those who make themselves mediators between God and us seek to displace the only one who has the right. Sixth, Jesus is the only one who has conquered death never again to die. It is God who justifies, who is to condemn. Christ Jesus is the one who died, more than that, who was raised, who is at the right hand of God, who indeed is interceding for us. Who shall separate us from the love of Christ? All pretenders lie mouldering in their grave. Seventh, Jesus is himself the true God who became human in order to show us the way to him. In the beginning was the Word, and the Word was with God, and the Word was God. And the Word became flesh and dwelt among us, and we have seen his glory, glory as of the only Son from the Father, full of grace and truth. He has made him known. The only God himself, incarnate in Jesus, remains the only way.